Did the U.S. pay Iran $400 million in a kind of ransom to secure the release of some American detainees? The Wall Street Journal says the Obama administration sent a plane filled with cash to Iran on the same day that four American captives were freed. CBS News correspondent Margaret Brennan. Senior U.S. officials claim the timing was coincidental and just the first payment of a separate $1.7 billion settlement. At the time, President Obama did not provide detail, but did say the money was meant to settle an outstanding legal dispute from before the 1979 Islamic Revolution. With your nuclear deal done, prisoners released, the time was right to resolve the, this dispute as well. But the administration never consulted Congress, according to Republican Congressman Ed Royce, who accused the White House of paying ransom to a state sponsor of terrorism. As details became public Tuesday, there were instant reverberations on the campaign trail. Republican vice presidential nominee Mike Pence. The administration airlifted $400 million in cash to Iran. You know, we cannot have four more years accommodating and apologizing to our enemies or abandoning our friends. The Wall Street Journal says the money was delivered on wooden pallets stacked with euros, Swiss francs, and other foreign currencies. CBS News correspondent Margaret Brennan on that story.